Yo, what is going on everyone? It is Memory here. We everyone, ladies and gentlemen, for the ninth episode of That Time, I got reincarnated as a slime. And we're going to hop right into this episode, everyone, and see what we got. We're not wasting any time. We're starting at the very beginning, zero seconds, and we're going to get started here in three, two, one, play. So, man, the previous episode, ah, oh, wow. Absolutely beautiful. Yo, Shizu's, like, last wish, her, yo, in, her last will. Giving that on to to remove. Now the thing that I was like baffled about from the comments, which I guess though it makes sense, is that like she's just actually like gone. Like I was like, okay, she's she might be inside of Remur still, like how like Veldora yo is and all of that. But I guess that's not going to be the case at all. Like yo, Remur literally is just yo one with her pretty much. So that's kind of it, it's not kind of it is sad, but. Knowing that her life and her will is in great hands with Remu, you know, that makes me feel a lot better. And I mean, we still have those parts of Shizu that now make Remu. So, yeah, that was something when you guys were talking about that in the comments. I was like, wow, really? So there was that. And then also what we left off the episode with, with uh, Gelmund, I think that was his name, who named Rigor. I did not remember that. I'm going to be honest. It was towards the beginning and it was very brief, but yeah, uh... So Gelmon, this isn't our first time hearing about him, but we did see him like name that orc, I think, or whatever the hell it was, um, Geld, I think the name was what he gave him, talking about like a great orc disaster and like wreaking havoc and, and, and all that. So that's what we're moving into now. Episode 9, Attack of the Ogres. So the village... Progressing, yeah, oh, dude. I cannot wait to see. I've been talking about this a lot, but I cannot wait to see what they make this whole thing into. Like, it's gonna be, it's gonna be magnificent. It's gonna be like a freaking empire. <laughs> Imagine. Must be something with the human form, then. Must be. Ah, uh, of course, of course, you gotta take care of the mask. Yeah. <laughs> what are you about to do, Remo? <laughs> what are you gonna do, Remo? I I figured it was gonna be something with the human form, like where nobody can see it. Hmm, hmm, this is like, like, this is like, uh, like an ape or something, like, the the first man, like, hmm, hmm, hmm. <laughs> and because, I mean, Remur is naked right now, so, yeah, it would be bad if probably someone came in and saw, <laughs> so... All of Ifrit's skills, including body double, have been analyzed. Oh, that is sweet. That is sweet. <laughs> that is so cool. But also could maybe be like a bad thing, you know? <laughs> Uh. <laughs> yeah, technically, because you are a slime. Yeah. Mm hmm. But, like, if you really think about it, like, in this form, in this human form, like, you, Remuro looks like a, like, part boy and the part girl as well. Like, you know, like, it, it's kind of like, it's like what, like those trap characters, you know, like, Remuro could, like, kind of classify as that. But the hair, you know, 
it more so looks like a girl, but technically Maru is is genderless. Oh, so yeah, now that looks like a boy. <laughs> See? <laughs> Can you make him with like huge opie? Oh, yes. Yes. Yeah, see, this is, <laughs> this is what I'm talking about. Like, this could be a bad thing, <laughs> you know? <laughs> uh. <laughs> oh, it has to be a feast. Primura is joining. <laughs> I was about to say, like, what what kind of idea just sparked in in Primura's mind? Now that I think about it, yeah, remember, like, in, in the slime form, never really ate all like that. Like, you know, hum you, uh, I wouldn't say human foods, but, like, normal-ish foods. So, now in the human form, it makes sense that remember will have some of that. <laughs> Gopta, yo! <laughs> Oh, I love little Gopta. He's such a savage. <laughs> That's an important question, though. That is an important question, though. <laughs> Although it's not, it's not going to happen, but... Gopta comes crawling back in. Hey, maybe, uh... Maybe Remuru can make one of the, the body doubles with the, the older female one for, for Gopta. <laughs> Just to satisfy him, but yeah, you know, we probably shouldn't do that because for Shizu's sake. Yeah, Remuru is right about that. Ranga. <laughs> Look at Gopta's. <laughs> he always gets the worst, man. But then, like, he's one of the strongest, so it's. Uses unification and separation to merge skills together, evolving them into new skills. Wow. Oh. Wow. Black flame. Remember, it just continues to get stronger and stronger and stronger. More abilities, more yeah, tactics, more everything apparently yeah well we learned about it so with the mask on he's like actually perceived as a as a human or like that's cool so like the whole aura, like the whole aura thing that we have going on with Remover, like around him, like that just totally gets suppressed. Uh oh, something happened. Oh, damn! <laughs> Gop does this. You're you're fine. Come on now, my boy. You'll be all right. 
He's like, I'm, the first thing he says, I'm gonna die. I'm, oh, yeah, we saw these characters in the OP. Oh, I mean, we are heading into like a new direction, a new arc of sorts. So, I mean, I guess it does make sense we're gonna see these characters finally, some new characters. <laughs> Instant heal. <laughs> Oh, shit. Damn. Ranga. Whoa. Yeah, see, we're seeing all these, these faces, man, that we that uh, we had in the OP that I've been waiting for. Yo, I've been waiting to get, get them. Jeez. <laughs> kind of brings me like flashbacks back to when she first like not she well when, when remover first healed them here's all the the ogres whole dang group of them as well as what six of them Orcs, or ogres. Man, look at this. like these character designs are just so. Like they each have their own distinct like looks and traits and you know things to them. I, I always uh, that's one of my favorite things about this this series. Okay, so nobody was killed. Nobody was killed. Evil Majin. Ah, <laughs> uh, it's not like that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly, exactly. It's not like that at all. So they're going to think, so that means Shizu must have killed some of their people the conqueror of flames like so they know of this mask you know shizu wore that mask so their first instinct is to think oh you know this is the person that killed our people i that's how i'm taking it at least i think Oh, this is Remover though. You, <laughs> this is Remover you're going against though. Well, night night. Oh, <laughs> yo, in the middle of the fight, like, like oh. Yeah, that's the way. That's the way to to tie her up, man. <laughs> that's the way. Jeez. Damn. Oh my god. Talk about putting these skills and these and these abilities to the to use, like. Like one V six All of them. Yeah. 
Yep. Yep. So they're pretty like you know, pretty knowledgeable, at least the old guy is. She's probably I mean, Saw's you know, been through a lot, you know, with how I mean how old he looks at least. <laughs> like he's probably been a lot of places, saw a lot of things. Yeah, there's a huge misunderstanding here. <laughs> yeah. Um oh. Oh shit. Just going for the head. So wait, the orcs have been messing with their people then or you know with the ogres which makes sense but what we saw at the end of the previous episode with with geld it must be geld and whatever he, this great orc disaster they were talking about Well, <laughs> as Rimuru was just saying, like, I can't let them know too much. I can't let them see too much. <laughs> I guess Rimuru kind of had to do that. <laughs> yeah, that's not going to do anything. That's not going to do anything. <laughs> oh, yeah, we know, we know that. If one of the things was not to have any effect on Rimuru, it would be fire. <laughs> Ooh. And now that's all going to be unleashed. That is all going to be... Yo. Damn. It's crazy how much is actually being suppressed when the mask is on. Like, oh my god. Like, even Raga. Look at Raga. Even Raga's like, holy shit. Oh, my lord. <laughs> wow. Wow. <laughs> they still are going to fight? I was just about to say that he has that pride. There's been a lot of ogres that have died apparently from their talk about like by the by the orcs. At least someone's trying to, like, see through this here and <laughs> see that there's possibly a misunderstanding. So does maybe Geld have a mask? Or... Or maybe uh, Gelmund? It's probably Gelmund, yeah! Right?
now that that's well, we're getting somewhere with it, with this being cleared up good show them show them <laughs> show them <laughs> yep <laughs> All good, all good. I mean, sh now we can help you out with whatever problem you, you know, what's going on right now and how their you know, people have been killed and all that. Seems like something removed, you know, could help them out and then it could become potential allies. And I would love to have them as allies just from what we saw of them in with this fight. That evens out. <laughs> You're gonna join the feast? Oh, okay. They like the sound of that. <laughs> So they fought before even like coming to reach understanding. They didn't. They didn't really talk it out. But then eventually, it came to the point where they talked it out, worked it out, cleared up the misunderstanding, and now we're gonna actually get what's going on. <laughs> that was a good episode, man. A lot, a lot of new characters introduced as well. Which, I mean, I guess it makes sense. You're know, going into a new arc. You know, as we just continue to adventure out and go to different places and you know deal with different things, like we're gonna meet a lot of new characters. So. Uh, yeah, so that was, that was really sweet, but seems like we definitely have something a lot, you know, bigger going on here, which, what we got left off with in the previous episode, you know, Gelman, Geld, you know, it has to be obviously revolving around that with like the orcs and all that, so, uh, so yeah, I'm excited to get more of these, you know, all these characters we met in this episode, I mean, we saw a little bit of their abilities, their powers, and kind of what they're about, a little bit on display, in in this episode but uh i'm talking about like even more so you know getting more into you know their abilities and their strength and just whatever else honestly like you know Love seeing everyone back together again as well. Like in the in the village. Continue to work on the village. I mean, just continue to grow all around. Like the next time, the Orc Lord. So yeah, that's where we're that's where we're moving into with like Geld and Gelmund and, and all that. Um and this I, if I remember correctly, there like Gelmund was talking about like something about a great orc disaster at the end of the previous episode. So I mean that makes sense what you know, with what's going on right now. Apparently, like how the ogres, some of the ogres have been killed or, or injured, you know, from from the orcs. So there's definitely something happening there. Um, so yeah, we're gonna get into that, help them out probably with you know what they got going on, and they're most likely eventually going to you know become allies. Just judging how the end of this episode went, what it you know led into, because uh, Remu is definitely going to to help out with this. So uh, yeah. I'm liking these new characters we had introduced so far, like what we had in this episode. Let me know what you all thought of this one. If you did enjoy the video, make sure you drop a like, subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you for watching. Peace.